Dang it, man. This is not gonna work. I mean, this, the whole thing, it's just, it's stupid. It's... Yeah, that was me. Let's see how this whole thing started, though. And make sure to stay till the very, very end. My husband is planning a surprise for me, and this is all he gave me. What am I supposed to do with this? I think this is gonna help you, Pete. A clue! Clue number one. Start by popping what makes up this heart. You will find your next clue, and your journey will come to a quick start. Start by popping <laughs> what makes <clears throat> up... <clears throat> Just keep This going way. Straight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> oh my gosh, there's a bunch of balloons in here! There's a balloon <clears throat> that has a little clue inside. Wait, this one says something. Keep going! <clears throat> the last one. <clears throat> Oh, second clue. You always have the clues, don't you? I do. Clue number two, you found it, hooray. Time to visit the spot where I asked you for your hand. In marriage? That's the reunion tower. That's where we're going. Okay, like she said, I'm planning a surprise for her. Let me tell you about it. So here's what I'm thinking. Valentine's Day's coming up. I thought Keely deserves something big this year. Let me show you. It's gonna be a massive Valentine's Day card that opens up, leads to a tunnel, and that's gonna lead her all the way over to the entrance where the date night's gonna happen. This is what the main area is gonna look like, and then it's just gonna be this big open space. I'm gonna build a giant heart to put in the middle. There's a lot to do, and my videographer, Alan, is sick today. Keely is already on her second location. Okay, all right, we gotta go. I have a feeling that today's video has something to do with Valentine's Day. I've never filmed a video like this where I don't know what's happening in a video. Video. All right, to the reading tower we go. Okay, I needed to get 31 by fours, a couple pieces of big pink panther foam, a nail gun, and some fasteners for that, and a few cans of spray paint. All right, I hope I stayed under $100. $548, I, I went over the budget. But I gotta hurry, I, I can't return anything. Stack, 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 stack. Back to the office. All right, I gotta clean all this stuff up. Clean all this, put some of this against the wall. Yeah, might need that for a fire. That's clear, so much more to do though. Okay, so we're inside the Reunion Tower. We have our friends here, remind me your name, Greg right. and Jonathan. Jonathan. They showed up and they're like, oh yes, come with us. We will take you upstairs to the tower. We're getting our own secret elevator. This is what the celebrities use, right? Without question. Only time I've ever been here was when Scott proposed. I remember when we got in the elevator, like I knew it was about to happen. I remember I was like here and I was like trying to focus on the view and my heart was just like <laughs> beating out of my chest. Okay, so we have Keely enter a giant Valentine's card right here. She has to crawl down and then it stands up. There's a hallway with sheets and twinkle lights. Go through this. Gotta make sure she doesn't hit her head. There's a final curtain. She goes through, and then all of a sudden it opens up. I'm gonna paint this wall. I have sheets draping right here, and then I'm gonna construct a big wooden heart right here. Editors, can you help me out with that? Okay, so you can see here, Scott's down on one knee, literally standing right here on the geodeck in the reunion tower, and then I stood right here, in front of this love is in the air sign, and so is love in the air. KeelyMerch.com. That's literally our tagline Ooh. right now on the website. Are you ready for your next clue? Yes. Oh my gosh, wait, this is so cute. This is your third clue, so look close. Your next destination is quite a sight, or maybe you are. Look next to the third tallest building. What does that even mean? Oh, Greg, do you know which is the third tallest building? Behind Bank of America. Behind Bank of America? Oh, behind the little Pegasus? Yep. Let me look on the map. <gasps> Oh, you know what's next to the Comerica Bank? It's the giant eyeball in Dallas. Is that where we're going right. next? Yep, yes. that's where we're going next. I needed to attach a few pieces of lumber to the wall so that I could tie in my structure. I definitely skipped a few steps, don't call OSHA. And this is gonna be the world's biggest interactive Valentine's Day card. I need to paint this with a base coat of white. I had to go over this a few times because the purple was soaking in all the paint. I wanted to put two colors of hearts on the wall so that it would really pop. I started decorating the Valentine's card. I really want this to be the grand entrance. Keely, tell everyone that you wanna skip out on your surprises for some Chick-fil-A. No, okay, look, we're on the way to the night eyeball. And there's a Chick-fil-A right there, okay? Okay, but is there at least a food stop? There's a food stop. Okay, good. After this one. Yomi, I see an eye. We can't, why can't we go see the eyeball? Keely, I'm sure you fit through here. I mean, I could, should I? Seeing the eyeball, now what? Is this where I get my next clue? Scott wanted to do a challenge with you. He wants you to find someone that looks like Scott, and you're gonna have to give them $20, and you have to take a picture with them. Okay, well now we're on the hunt to find the Scott look-alike. There's not a lot of people right now. It's 
a Tuesday at 3 p.m. Time to construct the heart. This took a lot of time so I could get the perfect shape. So this is the shape of the heart right now. It needs to be more rounded on the sides. Oh, that looks so much better. Okay, I decided I'm gonna spray paint the heart and I think I'm gonna use pink, magenta, and red. This heart turned out better than I wanted it to. I was originally gonna paint it all pink, but then I liked how the wood color turned out. This looks amazing. All right, we made a full lap around the eyeball and it's starting to look like we're getting some dry eyes around here because we can't <laughs> see anybody who looks like Scott. My sights just aren't on the right prize. So I'm gonna call him and see if I can change the challenge. Hello? So I'm at the eyeball and I'm trying to find your look like and there's no one that looks like you. So I have an idea, can I change the challenge? If I can get somebody to wear my Keeley hoodie and take a picture in it. Yeah, are you wearing something under it? Yeah, well duh, I'm not gonna take it off without wearing a t-shirt, Goober. <laughs> so now the bones of the structure are built and I'm gonna hang up the heart. I gotta walk on my tippy toes. Don't scratch the wall. Hey, hey, hey. Heck yes. I'm wearing my Be The Light Valentine shirt underneath it from KeeleyMerch.com. Hi, I have a quick question for you. So this is my new merch hoodie. Do you mind wearing it? And then we'll take a quick picture in it and you get 20 bucks. That looks pretty good on you here. Show it off to the cam. Let's do yeah, a spin. Do a twirl. Nice. Thank you so much. In Thank exchange, you. here's your 20 bucks. Okay, so we got our nice new friend, Nasiel. Boom, sent it to Scott. Next clue, baby. Let's get it. Clue number four, good job, but don't fall in love with him. Okay. <laughs> Just fall deeper with me. I don't think I have a problem, Scott, but okay. Remember where we had our first date? If I were you, that's where I'd be. <gasps> our first date was at a restaurant called Flower Child. The structure came together great. I finished the frame for the tent and started working on the tunnel. But as I was building more and more, I realized that I might run out of wood. So we're on the way to go eat at Flower Child, which I'm really excited about because Spawner's first ever date was there. Every year on the 20th, we always go back. But this year, we didn't go, actually. Well, now I guess I'll go, but I just won't be with Scott. <laughs> I'll be with Yomi. We have to sit in the booth, me and Scott sat in the first time. I am missing the lights, and I think I actually ordered them and they didn't come in in time. Oh my gosh, this supposed to be like an hour behind. Fairy lights, man, I cannot find these. Oh, here's someone. Hey, sir, hey, do you know where the fairy lights are? What do you know what? Uh, Bruh. Alan? Dude. What the heck are you doing here? You were sick. I'm really busy I right can't now. I believe gonna... you, Bryce. Scott, I'm really busy right now. What are you I... looking at? I'm looking, I don't know which one to use for golf. Film. No, please, Scott, no, I have the day Film off. Film me right now. I'm really behind. <sighs> Fine. Okay, I can't, I'll, we'll, we'll talk Can we about get this. these? No. We'll talk about this later. I gotta find Twinkle Lights. Okay, perfect. Okay, we're in a flower child. Look at this. Look how cute it is. There's actually flowers and plants like everywhere. I'll do the steak kids meal with um, mashed potato. Okay, Yomi, if you look to that corner right there, do you see that floral couch? Yeah. That's where me and Scott sat for our very first date. Okay, we have our food. We got both got kids meals, so it's like very tiny amounts. <laughs> I don't like how they put my steak on top of my mac and cheese. Our first ever date, Scott and I came here and we ate and we were both so awkward. I don't know, it's just like that young love awkwardness. Now. I'm going to enjoy my mac and cheese, and then we'll go on to the next uh, adventure, right? Okay, Yomi, I finished my meal. Where is my clue? <gasps> yes! All right, let's see what this says. Clue number five. Was that good? Savory? Some say food is the way to the heart. Time for you to figure this out. Sometimes in plain sight, yet you can't trust what you see. What am I? This puzzling word that starts with an I. Okay, then we have I dash 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 in. Italian? No, it's a puzzling word. It's a puzzling word. Is there an O? Yeah, it's right before the N. Island. No, wait, there's no O in island. <laughs> Dang it, I thought we were going to Cancun. Oh, illusion. Yep. Is that right? Yeah, oh wait, are we going to the Museum of Illusions? That's right, let's Freak, go. yeah. Wait, that place is so fun, yes. I, I could still be sick. I'm willing to risk it. Hey, yeah, we're gonna have to cancel our tea time. Scott found me. No, I told him I was sick. Preston, you said it was okay. Preston. Can you give me a second, please? You, so you can't get me out of this? No. Okay, we made it to the Museum of Illusions. Let's go inside and have fun. If you don't know what the Museum of Illusions is, it's basically a museum full of illusions. First and foremost, we have fun things like this, where if you stand and look at it, depending on the perspective you're at, it moves. This room's crazy, look in here. Super tall, uh-huh. Super tiny. <laughs> All right, you ready to see a cool illusion? Do you see the illusion? What is it? It looks like they're spinning on top of each other. Oh yes, it does. All right, Yomi, I know I'm here for illusions, but why else am I actually here? So, since it is the month of love and Scott wants to do something really sweet for you, uh -huh. I can't give you the next clue until you find a heart. Oh, I thought no. that shouldn't be too hard. 
Okay, Yomi, look at this room. It's upside down, right? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Does it look like I'm sitting <laughs> watching my favorite TV show? Nice. <gasps> Wait, Yomi! <gasps> literally, it's a heart no puzzle. No way. Wait, okay, Yomi, look. I'm literally about to figure it out right now. Boom, boom. Heart! I did it, I found a heart. And I solved a puzzle, which means I get my next clue. Let's go get it. All right, Yomi, give me the clue. Yeah, oh, and it's got a heart on it. All right, that was fast, good job there. You know what would make this better? A bear, but not the fluffy kind. Maybe a giant one's made of stone. You will find the next clue there with a gift. Go get her. <gasps> I know what he's talking about. It's the teddy bear park. Oh wait, you know what we went to the teddy bear park for? Our oh. six month anniversary date where Scott gave me a promise ring. So let's go, Aww. let's go see the teddy bears. What's up, Scott? Hello. Still not happy I'm here. Is it better than what you thought it was gonna be? Yeah, I like the cuts right here on the white sheet. Uh, you did it. Now there's no proof of that. There is. Nope. Quit deleting footage. <laughs> What's your game plan here? Why is there a bunch of white sheets here? This is what we're going for over the whole thing. And where you don't see hardly any of the wood exposed, you know? Nice. And so it's like a tent. This is actually taking less time than I thought it was going to. At the rate I'm going, I'm not gonna finish in time, but somehow it always works out, so. It's like production adds time or something. No, I don't add time. Kids just slow up. This is literally the park on the other side of this fence. How are we supposed to get to the teddy bear? Okay, look, there's the teddy bear. Excuse me, there's someone right there. Shut up, you scared me. Oh, look. Wait. Oh, it's a little gifty. Let's read the clue. I didn't know if you would actually do this. I hope you didn't cheat. Head to a store near you and a stranger you will meet. So you can choose the store. Hey, Scott, it's four o'clock. What? It's four o'clock. What the heck? I set up a tea time for No, you can't leave. Are you, I'm clearly behind right now, Alan. Preston said it was okay. Fine, if you wanna leave, you can leave. Okay. Never mind, I changed my mind. I need to delegate some things to you, and oh, my friend John can probably make the meal. The one that killed Josh? But he, uh, he kidnapped him, it's okay. I asked Chef John. Too expensive. <laughs> you know, maybe I will call Chef John. <laughs> hey, John! Hey, man. So I'm doing this build for Keely, and I'm in a big time crunch. I need a nice meal for us. Yeah, I don't think I have time to make it. I need it in one hour. All right, man, anything for you, I got you. Yes! All right, thank you, John. I'll see you soon. Let's go! Okay. I'm back on track. I'm, well, I'm kind of on track. I'm right beside the track on the dirt track, and I'm about to get, I'm like, my tires are getting fixed, you know, on the NASCAR thing, and. Okay, Yomi, so Scott said to pick a store, any store, and meet a stranger. All right, to Target we go! We've made it to Target, but I have a feeling there's another challenge involved. There is another challenge. You're gonna have to find a subscriber, give them this box, and here's the catch. You have to buy everything they fit in that box. What if I don't find a subscriber here? Can I find somebody to subscribe? Sure, yeah, that'll work. Hi, uh, do you want to be on a YouTube video? Yeah. yeah, okay, are you subscribed to my channel? My name's Keely. Do you want to subscribe? Yeah, can you press that subscribe button? Now that you're a subscriber, you have three minutes to fill this tin with whatever you want and I'll buy it. Ready? Three, two, one, go! <laughs> she is running! Oh, okay, oh, that fits in there, like, go ahead. Oh, she likes Star Wars. You got a minute, 50 seconds left, you can fit more. Do any of these fit? Okay, that kind of fits. You have one minute left. If you can carry it, I'll count it. Oh, she's picking something else. Oh, you wanna get that one instead? Oh, some Play-Doh, and grab it! Oh, time's up! Oh my gosh. All right, here you go, Liberty. Thank you for being in our video and being a new subscriber. Yay! We had fun, we bought stuff, we got it for the little kid. Now, where's my next clue? That's all of them. There's gotta be one more. You're right, there. you have to put all the pieces together. Oh, all the puzzle pieces? Break, okay, let's go. First things first, make your own pasta. Super easy. Just gonna roll this out until it's so thin. You can see through it. Roll it up. Cut nice and uniform. Fresh noodles. A little bit of pasta water there. Scott! I got something for you. What is this? Oh my gosh, that looks incredible. I want to eat this now without you. Like, you should. Uh, you're the best. I'll write you a check and cash it like at the end of the month or something. Cool, man. Five dollars. That's my fee. Yeah. Okay. okay. Gotta get all my pieces. Ah, this is hard. Why does this look like the shape of Montana? Like, Scott's way better at puzzles than I am. I think it'll be easier if you flip all of Ooh. them. Oh, I see. There we go. That's gotta go there. This is so fun. Oh my gosh. Okay, heart's gonna go here. Boom. Scott and I love puzzles. This is so on brand for us. I was there at the start and I'll be there at the end. Go to where it all began, where I met you and wanted to be more than a friend. Do I go to work? 
Yeah, he's gonna put you to work. Dang it, man, this is not gonna work. I mean, it's, the whole thing, it's just, it's stupid. It's not gonna work, man. Sorry, I overreacted. Yeah, you kind of did, but dude. I, I need your help. Okay. The rest of the tunnel started coming together nicely when Alan actually started to help me. Except when this fell, I almost lost it again. Anyways, the sheets went up and I could finally visualize memory lane. Keely said that she's on her way. You're kidding. No, I, why would I lie about that? Uh, it's so kinda... we're clearly not done. Um, hurry, let's hurry, let's hurry. Help okay. me, put the camera down. Sorry guys, you're gonna see it at the end. Okay, so Scott's clue has me going back to the office. Yomi, what is he surprising me with? You know. I, I can't tell you, Keely, I'll literally lose my job. Okay, wait, for Valentine's Day in 2021, he built me like a tent at work, actually. And then like a snowstorm happened that morning and we couldn't drive. And so by the time the ice melted, he had to go back to work and they made him take it down because like they needed the space. I never actually got to see it. He could be building me my own dream doghouse. Like your own for you to live in? Yeah, for me to live. <laughs> I'm so excited and so nervous. Okay, we're here at the office. I'm so nervous. Just follow me. Come on. Do I need these? Um, you can just leave them. Wait, where are you taking me? I am so scared. My <laughs> She's here. Congrats! You won my heart. Do I push through this? Try it. Ah! Oh my God, it's a board. I knew it. <laughs> Pictures of us. Hello? Oh my god, I love all these rugs. Hi, Alan. What are you doing here? Hi, Keely. Oh my god, it's like a little maze. Oh, another wedding picture. I like don't even feel like I'm in the office right now. Okay, stepping over this. Hi! Surprise! Oh. <laughs> Scott, this is so cute. I love his heart. It's the world's first interactive Valentine's card. So you get to enter it and experience it and have a date <gasps> in it. Oh my God, it's held up by zip ties. They're strong zip ties. Take a picture. This was truly the most magical experience. I'm so lucky oh, to have oh. someone like Scott to surprise oh, me oh, each oh. and every single day. Ta -da. And we have no utensils, I forgot. <laughs> Look at the napkins cut in the heart. I cut it myself and I made this food. You made one. this? Oh, John okay. made it. Oh, John made it? Oh my God, it's gonna be good. I had such a fun day. Me and Yomi had so much fun. Yay! Cheers. I love you. All right, you ready for one last surprise? There's more? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you ready? Here it is. <gasps> Wait, this is the rocker I wanted for our future nursery. Yeah, the exact one. Oh my gosh. Wait, this is so nice. I know, for our future baby. 